Okay, let's get it done. Hey, welcome back to Two Way Wolf. So for a long time, I've been wanting to do the swing out tire rack, but then it wasn't going to work out for the bumper that I had. I since have a new five by five thick steel bumper, and I went ahead and put some holes in it. And I was just going to put a bar across here to hold some stuff. But you know what? Screw it. I'm going to try it. I'm going to go ahead and just make my own tire carrier bumper. But I wanted to make it so that way I can take it off. And I did get a pin. What did I do with it? Right here. So I got one of those pins. So that way I can drop all the way through. I can pin it. It doesn't flex or anything. And that way I can take it off and move it up as I want. So you know what? Why not? Oh, and I picked up the scraps for... I got some uh, inch and a half by inch and a half. Pretty heavy steel. And I got it for... Oh, it's 10 bucks. So I got um, 12 feet of that for 10 bucks at the scrapyard. So I love those guys. So uh, yeah, we'll try to get it done. So a little bit of drive fit. Um, I've been getting better at the welds. They still look like crap, but I have been getting better at the welds. But so uh, there will be a pin here, and so that kind of goes out like that. And the tire is going to be on that part. Uh, the biggest thing that I'm debating right now is um, I kind of want the tire, the tire is going to block the bottom of the door, which means I'll have to open this up to open that up. And I really don't want that. So I'm going to, I don't know. Now the, my spare tire is 33, 33 inches, and my normal tires are 35. Um, I don't know. So, I really don't want it too low, but then again, can't have it too high, I guess, because it'd be nice if I can get it right about here so that door can open. I don't have to open this every time I want to access the back. So, okay, so I'm going to clean it up a little bit and do another coat of paint on it. I got to sand it down and stuff. I should have. I should have sanded it down and not painted it at all, but I was thinking it would have been easier to paint it first and leave just the ends not painted, but yeah. So I'm going to go through, I'm going to sand it and get it cleaned up and then uh, put a couple coats of paint and maybe some clear coat on as well. Okay, can't really see it because it's uh, low light, but um, went ahead and put the second coat on. Um, I did test fit everything and it seemed like it was working pretty good, but I got the second coat and then I'll go through and I'll put the clear coat on it. So I think, I think it'll turn out pretty good. I'm afraid to touch it. I want to touch it. What if I touch the bottom? Oh, that's feeling pretty good. 
it's uh, hot, but it is humid today. So it doesn't feel sticky at all. So yeah, looking pretty good. I'll have to get some clear coat and put a clear coat on it. <sighs> all right, got done with it. So put a clear coat on it, nice and red. And then uh, I just pull this pin that holds it in place. And then I got a little rubber block, so that way if there's any kind of vibration, I don't have to worry about that. And swings on out. Now I just have a steel rim for a spare. So I'm going to order a aluminum rim. I, I want to get the same. These are 35s. That's a 33. But I want to get an XD series aluminum rim. That would take some of the weight off. So I think that'll work. I think that'll work just fine. Did do one other project. I put this uh, pole here, and basically I can just put a hook up there so I can do the hanging shower. So that way, when it gets really hot, it is like 90 degrees and it was raining this morning, so pretty hot. So that way, if you get hot and sticky, you can rinse off. So that's kind of nice. Um, my shirt is soaked. Oh, so speaking of shirts, so Scotty won uh, won the shirt on the last drawing. There's a picture of Scotty. Um, I want to thank uh, Tim out of California. Um, he donated through uh, Venmo. So if you guys want to donate to the truck or one of the trips or something, you can do that. I highly appreciate it. I'll send you a shirt. Uh, you can look up 2A Wolf at Venmo. And uh, yeah, if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them down below. I'll see you next time. Whew on 2A Wolf.